Okay, so one uh, slightly more advanced use of chat GPT is what are called custom GPTs. You can see here where it says explore GPTs. And what that is, is a, a, a chat conversation into which you have provided it some sort of standing instructions that apply every time you, you run it. And so I have an assistant district governor club visit report assistant, which we'll take a look at here. And the meat of the uh, thing is this description of what it's for. Uh, it takes voicemails from Rotary assistant district governors and rewrites them for clarity uh, and then ab abstracts them into an assistant district governor report. The report format is included right here. And then I ask it to use the club name that's mentioned to get the assistant district governor's name, the area, and the name of the, uh, the area. So you can see down here below, all that stuff is listed. It's kind of a little database-ish sort of thing. So if we go to, uh, ah, two other things that it uses. One is the fact that uh, I have a Google voice number and you can sign up for these. And when my assistant district governors call this Google voice number, then they can leave a voicemail. Well, what Google Voice does at that point is it transcribes the voicemail. You can see the transcription here and then sends it to me in an email, which you can see here. So what I do is I copy all the text from that email. I paste it into ChatGPT, into the customized uh, assistant, and it generates an assistant district governor report which I would then send to Diane and uh, then she would edit it or approve it. And then we would stuff it into the Google Drive folder that contains these things. So that's that for that.